Bill, I need a drink. Well, where's your bottle? When I woke up this morning, it was gone. Gee, that's too bad. Yeah, sorry, Tommy. I wish we could help. I don't get it. How come you guys can have bottles and I can't? I don't know. How come Angelica gets to go to daycare all day and we don't? They took my bottle away and gave me this dumb cup with a happy face on it. Did you do anything bad? I don't think so. They took me to this guy who put his fingers in my mouth. Did you buy them? Nope. Weenie? At one year old? That's the dumbest thing I ever heard. My pediatrician, Doc Mulligan, doesn't even want me to think about winning until the twins are two. I know, but the dentist said... Did you get a look at his dental school diploma deed? Eh, guy's probably a quack. Um, do you want to share? We're not supposed to. Oh, a little sip? <laughs> i give you something. What? My stacking Godmother, just off to bed. Uh, already taken my pills. So they tend to make me a bit drowsy. So, um, how about um, we, we make this a quick visit? What? what? Oh. oh, hello. <laughs> so, what's new? Uh, you remember my son, Prince Charming. Charming? Oh, is that you? My gosh, it's been years. Uh, when, 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 when did you get back? Oh, about five minutes ago, actually. After I endured blistering winds, scorching desert, I climbed to the highest room in the tallest <laughs> tower. Mummy can handle this. He endures blistering winds and scorching desert. He climbs to the highest bloody room of the tallest bloody tower. But, but, and what does he find? Some gender-confused wolf telling him that his princess if I could just... is already married. I mean, it wasn't my fault. He didn't get there in time. Stop the car! Ah! Harold, 